All right, so here we are. Here's the uh, Cubify 3. We just arrived uh, fresh in the mail. Let's see what the box looks like. It's actually a nice uh, uncube like box that we received. So to open the box, here's the, uh, there's some original handles here that need to be opened up like this. And then uh, we are able to open the box here. Like so. So there's a handle here. And uh, here's the box itself. So if we look inside the box, we can see that it comes with the uh, quick start guide. Looks uh, like only uh, about 30 pages. There's, uh, what is this? I think this is the glue that I have ordered. I oh, know, it's a USB stick. So if you open it up. Inside is the, yeah, it's the Cubify USB stick. So this is what goes inside the computer. You upload your files here, your STL print files, and then you plug it inside the printer, and then you're able to print. I'm going to put that aside. The regular protective foam that is here. That is nice. And okay, so this part of the box, this compartment here, is uh, where we get our cables. So they're packed separately. Okay, so we'll open it up like this. basically the accessories that come with it. So here's the actual uh, filament. So these are the uh, these are the custom cartridges that come with the Cubify 3. You can order them separately. I ordered two, so you can see in the box we have two of them. That's the problem with the Cubify 3 printer. One of the problems is that uh, these are custom made, so you cannot get the filament from a different company. Uh, you have to get them from Cubify. I guess that's how they make their money. To open it up, I'll need a I need some kind of scissors. We'll get to them in just a second. Let's show you the printer itself. So apart from it in the box, we have the, uh, the standard cable. Looks like the monitor cable. And this package. And this package here. So this package contains, which is not very well sealed, is the glue. So that's what you're supposed to put on the base when you print. This is the spatula that you uh, scrape off the 3D objects with. And apart from there, what else is inside? Okay, so you have like, uh, they give you actually small pliers. So you can see the pliers are dirty, which is uh, not nice. Some kind of machine oil that's on them. Put them here. Okay, so that's just uh, the power block. It goes with the Cubify printer. And for the printer itself. So that's what it looks like inside. We're going to take it out now. And be careful when doing that. Here's the printer. So I ordered it in uh, gray. It, uh, it's, it's not a very light shade of gray. But, uh, uh -huh. as you can see, there's... Okay, so as you can see inside here, there's the... Uh, uh, there's some carton that's inside. Actually, if you look at it from the top here, you can see that that's where the uh, part was when we take it out. It has the uh, has this part here, which looks interesting. So from the side, if we look, we have uh, some more carton here, which we're going to remove. Here. And so let me just here like so. So, okay, let me show you the front of the printer, of the uh, 3D printer. There we go. That's what it looks like from the front. There's uh, some more plastic here that we need to remove. There's the uh, this part here. Oh, okay, so I'm guessing you remove this from the base. And so this is the magnetic base that people keep talking about. So this actually comes with the magnet. So when you drop it in, you see there's three uh, three holders here, just drop it in, and it actually goes in place. So even if I go from this angle here, or from this angle here, it always drops on the three pins, like the three pins they go here, like this. 
Printer is very cold, it's minus 40 right now and uh, minus 30 in Canada, so you can see the side here. There is uh, some explanations when we remove this. And the same thing on the side here. So this is, I guess, where you're going to put the filament. So the filament box, let's open it up. Okay, it's completely protected from the light. Like so, and this is what it looks like inside. I saw a review by a previous uh, YouTube reviewer. There's actually not a lot of reviews right now of Cubify 3 on the net. Uh, it has the explanation here. They're saying that the only problem with this, and I can't confirm because I haven't used it obviously, is the um, uh, is the actual nozzle, the one that does the uh, the printing here. Let me remove it. They're saying that it gets pulled out, like this part here. I'm not sure. I haven't used it obviously, but uh, we'll see. But that was one of the warnings. They're saying the company said that they're going to fix it, and actually, if this does happen, that it jams. Uh, the company is going to replace it for you for free. Uh, hopefully it's not going to jump, so we don't know, but uh, we're going to test it out. So this actually goes on the side here. You attach it here, and then the actual printing takes place. That completes our uh, video of unboxing of Cubify 3 by 3D systems. Thank you.